Hey y'all, it's me Barb. Guess what I've got? This is just gonna be a fun little video. This is a fun little review here. It's Aftershocks Popping Candy. Now, I don't know what this is all about. It's a gummy fruity fries with Aftershocks Popping Candy. Now, come on, let's have some fun. It's inside gummy fruity fries with dipping popping candy. Well, you know, that sour stuff gets to me. It says, look at that, it says, lick them, dip them, and eat them. Ooh! <laughs> I thought this would be a fun one to review just for fun and giggles for the summer. You know, well, any time of year, really. I always, now this is something I suppose you wouldn't want in the car. I don't know, we'll find out. I just cut this open. Let's see what it looks like inside. Oh, well, let's look, see, it has, well, you can't really see. So inside you get some fries. Oh, they're individually wrapped, well, that's good. Oh, you only get three fries. Isn't it funny how when they package things, they make things look bigger than they are? And then you get these three little popping candy packets. So, well, that would be a fun little thing if you got three children or teenagers or whatever. Or adults. Shoot. <laughs> I'm trying it. <laughs> okay, well, that's funny that they did this individually. I thought there'd be a whole bunch of fries and a big thing of popping candy. But this may be even better because that way... Now, usually that popping candy... I don't know how it would stick to a fry, so we'll have to see what this is about. Well, let's look at the back real quick. <clears throat> Where is it made? You know I like to say that. Iowa? Well, it's a product of China. Hi, China. You know I always like to give you a shout out when you're working so hard over there. And it's a foreign candy company, dot Inc. So, um, oh, it's got all sorts of stuff in here. But for one package, it's 130 calories, 33 grams of carbs. 22 grams of sugar. Ay vey. <laughs> anyway, let's try it. I love this package. That's why I got it. I just, see, I, I just, I, I've said this before. I think marketing, I lost my calling. I just don't have the technical abilities to do marketing, but I like these ideas. Okay, well, let's start. So here's a French fry that they give you. Let me put this over just in a little individual packet. So we'll cut it. Boop. This will be a short video. Well, you know, whenever I say it's going to be a short video, <laughs> it's being long. Okay. So, here's the fry. It's got a little sugar on it. I'm sorry. See? There you go. Boop, 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 boop. The sun is everywhere. Well, it's summertime. It's some, 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 summertime. Well, how's your summer going, you all? How you doing? Um... It's been a weird summer for me. I, I feel like I lost June. My health wasn't so good, but I'm popping back up. I'm popping back up with popping candy. <laughs> anyway, okay, I'm going to cut this open. They have a little tear spot, but I'm afraid. You know me and how I spill things. Okay. Oh, well, maybe I should have tried that. Well, no, it's, it's very, oh, very little of this candy, which is good, <laughs> probably. So, but it's kind of nice, actually, that it's individual. I don't know if you can see that. And there you go. See, it's just in there on the very bottom. We take our French fry. Let me read the instructions again. Where'd it go? <laughs> um, lick them. Oh, so you lick the French fry. Then you dip them, and then you eat them. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to follow the directions. Aftershocks. Popping candy. Oh, I didn't lick it. See? You're just licking it tastes good. It tastes like, what does it taste like? Kind of like a light Kool-Aid. Let me take a bite of one. It almost tastes like, well, it's fruity, but it almost tastes like a, um, a harder kind of, um, oh, what do you call them? Oh, you know those chicks you get at Easter? What are they called? Oh, gosh, I'm losing my mind. I'm losing my mind. Um, those, um, Oh, you know what I mean. The little chicks, the the marshmallow peeps, the peeps. But only a little firmer and, and fruity. I don't know if that helps you. Okay, let's do what they say. Let's follow the instructions, Barbara. Come on, girlfriend. <laughs> okay, here we go. Click. And then you dip. Let's see what happens. <laughs> see? And then you eat. Oh, my goodness. Ooh, doggies. 
Pop, pop, pop. Oh, crack, snap, snap, crack, snapple, pop. <laughs> Rice Krispies, not Rice Krispies. This is kind of fun. I think you could take a really tiny bite. The gummy isn't really, the, the french fry gummy isn't really hard and it's not really super soft either. Let me take a smaller bite. It's not too sour. It's a bit sour. It's funny because you get the popping, still popping, and then you get the sour, but then you get the sweet of the gummy. Kind of like a marshmallow fruity flavor. It takes you on a journey. Look at me with my little pinky up. So you all, how are you doing? You know, I was thinking about this aftershocks. How do you guys deal with like um, stress, like, you know, or crisis? Like for me, I'm one of those people that I get super focused, believe it or not. I get super focused. Oh, did you see my earrings? <laughs> I'm not focused right now. But they're little French fries. I thought that was good for this. Um, but I, get, I do get super focused and I just get like bing, 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 bing. I have to say, I'm pretty darn good in a crisis. And I I have energy forever. Like, I can stay up all night if I have to, which I've had to before in crisis and, and all that kind of stuff. But then, like a day or two later is when I just kind of like collapse and I'm just like out of it, got to sleep, got to just veg and stare. But um, everybody's different. You know, they say fight or flight, but it's really flight, fight, or flee, or freeze. You know what I'm trying to say, don't you? Fight, flight, or freeze. Some people freeze in a crisis. And um, some people run away. And some people just get right in there. So, um, anyway. You never really know. You think you know, but you never really know until you're in that crisis. Or in a crisis. Okay, let me take another bite. Woo! It's fun. I don't think it's the best tasting little gizmo. It's just a fun little gimmick for the kids around the pool or at the lake or at the ocean. Pull that out as a little fun thing. You gotta be careful in the summer though. Sugar in the summer is very tricky. Um, I'm not licking first. It's very tricky in the summertime because, because, um, I just like the popping in your mouth. I think it feels so cool. I loved, I, I gave a whole bunch of those popping candies to, to staff one time, and it was great. Some of them had never had it. And watching them react, they're all, they're all just like, dee, 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 dee. and then they're like, whoop, whoop. <laughs> it was fun. I love it. You know, what I rather do is just dip this in here after I lick it and just suck the snap, crackle, pop. That's what it is, snap, crackle, pop. Popping candy in my mouth. Because the gummy isn't my thing. Of course, you know I'm not a big gummy eater, but I still think it would be fun for the kiddos. And I think you could have this in a car if you've got older kids like 8 and out above. Or maybe 10 and over. But, you know, in the fall, it would be good for a hike. I don't know. Or just, you know, I think, um, or just having something in the cupboard for when the kids are just going a little, they just need a little pick-me-up, pull this out and say, hey, let's try this together. Notice I said together. A little bit of sour, but not too much. I'm having fun with this, you all. Well, one out of ten, one, you're going to get sick on the side of the road, you never want to hear or speak of it again and make it sick Woo! and there's popping all over and then 10 is you can't stop thinking about it you can tell all your friends and you're gonna go back for more well for me <laughs> um i think one out of 10 is definitely above a five i feel like there's a lot of these candies that last longer that have more of the popping stuff and all that stuff but, you know, you really could just get the popping candy and put a gummy in there as your... But um, for me, it's really not my thing. It's it's probably a six or six. I'll, I'll call it a six and a half. Oh, there's a dragonfly right in front of me. Oh, God. It flew through my car window 
in front of the, I don't know if you saw it. I don't think you saw it. I think it was below the camera lens. And then it flew out the other window. I love nature. Nature. Hey, this is fun. Creativity, packaging, and bring it up to an eight. But I say, flavor-wise, it's really like a six. I mean, it's fine. It's fun. Maybe it's a seven. I don't know. I say six and a half. Mm. Well, that was fun. Just a little shorty bitorty. I'm trying to do all different lengths of videos. <laughs> anyway, you all, I hope you're having a fun summer. And if not, maybe try to think of what you liked in, in your childhood. What kind of things did you like to do? I remember I was talking to somebody and they're like, oh, I would never color. That's what I did in my childhood. I go, oh, I color all the time. I don't color all the time, but usually on vacation, I try to color, color something. Or if I'm camping in the evening, I might try to color a little something just with colored pencils. You know, just kind of relaxing, you know. I mean, sometimes I think people try to be such an adult that they forget that you can just have fun with life and just walking in the woods or, I don't know, making a little. Remember how you used to take the blades of grass and go, you know, doing stuff like that it's okay it's not being immature immaturity is when you don't treat people right and and you're, you're only thinking of yourself and and not following through with an idea I mean following through with a process of thought you know what I mean um, but anyway I'm not gonna get all into that all I'm gonna say is this was a lot of fun aftershocks popping candy I think it's a win I think that you know probably an eight one out of ten but I said a seven because the french fry taste isn't really my thing, but it's not bad. Is my car running? You all, I had the air conditioning off and everything, and the car was running the whole time. I hope it didn't bother you. Well, I'm not going to be able to do it again, but I just want to say, hey, thanks so much for watching, and, you know, have a good day. Have a fun day. Have a popping day. <laughs> anyway, oh, goodness. Okay, you all, take good care, and until the next time, bye-bye.